Hello and welcome back to my channel. I really appreciate the ones who have subscribed to my channel, who view my readings and uh, you know the ones who are passing on their love and support to my channel. I really 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 appreciate your love uh, and if you're new to this channel, welcome. Uh, please do hit the like notification bell icon so that you are notified of you know any new readings or any content that i put out there now first of all uh, you know i do not i never i generally don't do such early august prediction uh, but i was i got a message uh, and i was channeled to do this august prediction for you guys and um, uh, especially for a lot of you who need to hear this uh, there are few that I think at this point in time are going through extremely tough times and trial and tribulations in their life it's especially for you okay whoever you are whom I'm connecting with either you are facing strong financial issues career issues or um, you know something is not working out something is not working out you have tried um, like you have tried multiple ways and it's still not working out and you are looking for a sort of solution I'm not sure how much of solution that I can give you in a general reading but I just tapped into someone's energy in my meditation today and I got this message from my spirit guides and my angels um, you know and Archangel St. Michael to do this video okay a very early August prediction for whoever who needs to hear this if it resonates with you please do comment I would really really appreciate you commenting sharing this video liking you know um, referring this video to your friends because um, it's absolutely free of cost and by you doing so you're supporting my channel you're supporting those people who are deserving to receive this intuitive message through my channel luminous guide okay so please do that however uh, a little disclaimer again this is a general reading it is not gender biased not gender specific so please take how it resonates or leave it be if it does not resonate with you and uh, if you require a personal reading you please connect with me on instagram please dm me on instagram or you can email me on the information below okay so uh, again this is a reading it's an august prediction to anyone who who has tapped into this reading someone who's going through a lot of financial issues at this point in time or you're going through uh, you know some sort of health issues love issues relationship issues you are in a crossroad okay uh, this is my intuitive self that I am picking up this energy you're in a crossroad you do not know what to do you do not know what option to take you do not know where to go you do not know whose help or advice to seek hence this is your help over here at my channel okay maybe you are stressed you are bored uh, you are not or some of you who are students or non-students also you're getting bullied you are being bullied at your workplace you are being bullied in college you've been bullied in uh, school in your love life you're going through some sort of violence okay uh, that is happening or you have so much of responsibility on your shoulder which is too much for you to handle or fathom at this point in time and you were looking for a necessary uh, you know solution or a counseling you just want someone to hear you and you do not have uh, the means where someone can hear you or someone can give you a possible solution so this is an early prediction for you on what you need to do in the month of august and i hope this reading genuinely helps you okay so first of all there are these three options i mean not three options sorry three information that i've got talks about satisfaction talks about discernment and talks about past okay obviously you are going through a lot of chaos in your recent past and you need that satisfaction for your future but you need to work on your today to ensure that you have a better future right so what you need to do is you let the energy of love let the energy of intuition let the energy of your divine 
um, you know, spirit guides guide you, okay? You don't need anybody's approval at this point in time for your today to be better because if your today is better, your tomorrow is going to be better. Work and act on discernment, okay? Work and act on dis discernment. Do not, it's like, you know, what your right hand does, you should not let your left hand no kind of situation so that is what you need to do for a lot of you that who's tapping into this energy you i see that you must be having great plans uh you know but you're not executing your plan because of lack of investment so you have your plans you have your vision which you need to focus on but uh you go blabbering it around the city and then somebody else takes that plan and executes it because they have the investment and the power to do so so what is it that you need to do, right? What you need to do is you need to work on your investment. You need to maintain discernment. You need to maintain the quiet because everybody here is not listening to you uh, just to help you out. Maybe some of them are just listening to you. Uh, see, sharing, okay? Oversharing. Uh, sharing is good. Sharing of what you have more is good but oversharing of thoughts is not good at this point in time share your love share your knowledge don't share your ideas and plan okay this is a message that i've tapped into please whoever it resonates share your meal share your love share your knowledge do not share your ideas and plans with people you do not trust or people that you think are going to misunderstand that or they may use it for their own benefit okay do not do that all right that's your advice for the month of august and existence okay work on your existence number one could be significant to you work on your existence see it's you can look at this like you know, uh, maybe you resonate a lot with lotus, water lilies, uh, everything that grows in the muck that turns out to beautify the nature, right? Get grounded and connected to nature. I mean, look at this lady. She is carefree. She is sitting on that leaf and looking at the, um, you know, solar system at this point in time. She's wishing upon her star, right? This is what you need to do. You need to observe and share only that is required do not overshare observe okay that's what i'm saying if you're going through this difficult times it's it's going to move away stop clinging to the past number five could be significant so a lot of you are clinging to the past it could have been would have should have could have yes it it would have been great if things had to turn a certain way but I don't know about you guys sometimes i feel that you need to go through this problem okay because it is happening for a reason if this problem had not to coexist you would have not been capacitated to work on yourself or you know um, find a solution so you need you had to go through this problem do not cling to oh my god if this would have been then this could have been and then this should have been because it does not make sense at this point in time would have should have could have okay leave that in the past stop clinging to your past stop clinging to the things that did not happen right in your past and that could have turned into right look at it as an opportunity okay the high priestess again what did i say zip it up maintain a secrecy okay maintain a secrecy the high priestess is number two it's all about intuition but she's mum she's somebody who does not speak she she is somebody who knows it all but does not speak so a very very strong message for you guys whoever is clicking on this and it's either black or white like no gray matter yeah uh, and work on your emotional energy like the moon goes through phases so in our life we also go through phases the new moon is set for manifestation the full moon is for a completion so if you want to manifest something start with the new moon and watch it um, you know happen um, or watch it completion as the moon is changing its cycle see death card maybe you're a scorpio or dealing with a significant scorpio number 13 is significant three plus one is four that number could be significant death card not necessarily means a physical death it also means 
that you are waiting for some completion of a cycle something needs to die like a bad habit needs to die for good habits right something needs to die at this point in time the death of a cocoon is a transformation of a butterfly right that's where you race to metamorphosis right so there clearly needs an ending for a new beginning right that is what is happening and look at this number two again so two two could be significant you're seeing a lot of synchronicity of two two see you're in the crossroad exactly the energy that i've tapped into to whoever is listening to this blindfolded on the crossroad you do not know what decision to make at this point in time and uh, you could be a significant air sign could be a gemini libra or aquarian not necessary but you may have air in your chart the moon is really paying, playing a strong role in your uh, in your charts at this point in time get your moon sign checked okay check what's the possibility that you need to do through astrology if required or a simple solution when your emotions are imbalanced at this point in time you're not able to decide due to emotional factors just take water okay just like take water in a glass talk to that water give that water loving vibes and pray to that water and drink okay drink that water because water holds a lot of energy right and it's going to help you stabilize this is exactly those people who are in crossroads who are in two roads and do not know what decision that you have to make if there is someone who's specific who needs to know what decision they have to make and need to reach out to me for a complete reading please feel free to do so please do so please do so okay um two of swords again dealing with an air energy wow look at this be be quiet that's that's what it is talking about that it is talking about uh you have blindfolded yourself start observing okay tap into your intuition and start observing start observing and that's when you will know what decision that you need to make i need one more card please just to clarify one more card please there the queen of wands beautiful beautiful get into your fire element get into the strong energy that you have which you have not tapped into maybe a lot of you are pet lovers uh, you know get into the fire element uh, element you could be an aries leo sagittarius or you may have strong aries leo sagittarius in your chart there is a new beginning okay look at this there is a new beginning that is there okay there is definitely a new beginning that's there from being discreet to a significant ending where you're in a crossroad you're getting into being the queen of wands who is very fierce who is all love and there is a new beginning so there is a new beginning for you at the horizon this this phase is definitely going to end look at the bottom of the deck fool's card zero you got to start with a new beginning there's a new chapter of your life sorry about that there's a new chapter of your life waiting to start somebody's feeling left out in the cold five of pentacles their wheel of fortune so the wheel of fortune is right below these two cards right right below these two cards number 10 how will you spin the wheel if you feel left out in the cold and you've not started the new chapter of your life you got to go through this process for it you have to go through this process let's see what are the messages from our angels for you today i am strongly tapping into somebody's energy and that person needs to take a complete reading if not from me from whoever you believe or trust in but do that because you are going through disturbance at this point in time and you are feeling like helpless and you do not know what to do stop clinging to your past stop oversharing and wear do not just wear a blindfold on your eye zip it zip it and keep it okay zip it and keep it let's see what your angels have to tell today what are the guidance from my angels for our viewers today what are the guidance from the angels for our viewers today let's check what are the guidance from the angels for our viewers today choose a new direction wow look at this message so clearly the one that was clinging that you're clinging to the past was not serving you right so choose a new direction choose a direction that is good for you take action 
take action and you are ready and you will only be ready once you've gone through all this process choose a new direction choose a direction that serves you right beautiful beautiful message that i've tapped into and a beautiful reading that i've tapped into let's see who's here to guide you in the month of august or guide you right from now onwards what a beautiful reading i love this reading it's just it, there's so much of clarity if you clear your head you know if you just clear your head you will get into the clarity mode things are not working out right with your siblings things are not working out right with your family things are not working right at your workplace in your relationships health could be whatever okay could be whatever at this point in time no problem because you got to choose a new direction there is something happening for you oh green tara protection see she's a beautiful goddess okay green tara she's um, somebody who is absolutely beautiful she's very much connected and rooted to nature and see we, we spoke about lotus and water lilies that's what you're attracting uh, talking about intuition you need to open your third eye right you need to tap into your intuition you're protected cards are being cords are sorry cords are being cut move beyond limitations trust you need to trust here on your intuition your gut feeling cut the cords that does not serve you right okay and move beyond limitation your mind is limiting you your mind it's all in your head that song you know in your head in your head was the zombie listen to that song uh, i think cranberries i'm not sure listen to that song because it's all in your head okay and green tara ma is here to protect you you you, you are supremely guided protected work on your heart chakra you get connected to nature take a walk in nature because that is really important for you to clear your mind and you have lord krishna here oh my g look at the bottom of the deck we have lord ganesha lord krishna lord ganesha lord of lotuses lord of lotuses i'm going to take this for you guys okay lord of lotuses devotion infinite abundance okay abundance in everything that you're looking for is here for you okay it's here for you tap into the right energy tap into the right element tap into your devotion tap into you know everything like you see why do we wear a bindi on our forehead just right between our eyes because that's that needs to be protected we are always seeing our third eye is always seeing but you have to practice it you have to put in that effort and practice it you really need to meditate okay a lot of you like ladu sweets all that situation is happening connect with your divine guidance whoever is guiding you because you have infinite abundance in whatever you do you need to just get into the mode of devotion you need to believe that you're supremely protected trust your spiritual guidance okay your obstacles are being removed your obstacles are being removed as we speak right now i wish you all the best this was your reading i hope you loved it please connect with me like share subscribe and i send all my love and joy to you till we meet again goodbye